Hi there, my name is Edgar. Salon by Premier Software has the ability to take various types of deposits, such as a prepayment. This may involve taking money in advance for use against future purchases, or to hold another type of deposit income instead of offering a client a refund. So today I'll be showing you prepayments using Salon. First, open your Salon application. Once here, click on Reception. You'll be taken to the Diary screen. If a client wishes to place a deposit, this can be done through the departure screen or client sales screen. In this example, the client is ready to depart. On the billing screen, click the prepayment icon. A new row will be added to the screen above. From here, head to the unit price field. Click this. You can now input the prepayment amount that the client wishes to pay. Once done, click the green tick to continue and click the method of payment the client wishes to use. Click the green tick to pay for the prepayment. You can also view how much a client has made in prepayments. Back on the diary screen, click the clients tab at the top of the screen. From here, click the clients icon. You can then search for the client through any method you wish, such as their surname. Click the magnifying glass to bring up a list of matching clients, then click their name to highlight them. Head to the green tick to enter their client card. In a client card, click the account tab. This will be where you can view information such as loyalty points and pre-payments. The latter of these will be shown halfway down the page. Clients will also wish to redeem their prepayment amounts as once sold to a client is classed as a method of payment. To do this, click the back arrow to head back to the main diary screen. Prepayments can be used against any appointment or stock item. When on the billing screen from either a departure or client sale, the prepayments will show in the top right of the screen. As soon as an item is added to the bill, the prepayments icon will be highlighted within the Till Messages section. This will often show further details to the right. Once the client is ready to pay, click any Till Messages icons that are highlighted, such as prepayments, as well as the green tick button. Once on the payment screen, you can click the prepayment redemption button. This button and value will only show if the client has a prepayment balance. If the prepayment value matches or exceeds the bill value, the required amount will now show adjacent to the payment method. If there isn't enough prepayment to cover the entire bill, you will receive a prompt to confirm this. Click OK to continue and then pay the balance with one of the other payment methods. When the payment has been selected, click the green tick. In certain situations, you may need to refund a prepayment. If this is ever needed, head to the reception diary screen. Click the tilling tab at the top, then the client sale icon. Identify the client as before and click the green tick. From here, click the prepayment icon. In the unit box, enter the amount you wish to refund, making sure you put a minus sign in front of the value. Press enter on your keyboard once ready. You will then be presented with a prompt stating you are doing a prepayment refund. Is this correct? As it is correct, click yes to continue. You can then click the till messages that are highlighted, then the green tick. From the billing screen, you can then select the payment method for refund, typically using the same method of payment as the original purchase. Click the green tick to complete your prepayment refund. For more Salon how-tos, tips and tricks, why not subscribe to us on YouTube and click the notification bell to receive updates as soon as they are available. We also have several social media networks for you to follow for regular Premiere Software content. In the meantime, check out our other helpful videos, and I'll see you next time.